Hello, in this video we will be going over how to schedule an appointment through the EAB Navigate app. If you haven't already, you must first download the Navigate Student app from your phone's app store. This app will allow you to get connected with your academic advisor and other HCCC resources. The first thing you have to do when downloading is you must look up Hudson County Community College. Next, it's going to ask you to log in. You're going to log in with your regular HCCC student credentials. Your username is going to be the first initial of your first name, your last name, the last four digits of your student ID number at live.hccc.edu. For your password, for new students, it's going to be your birthday, two-digit month, two-digit day, and the last two digits of the year. For continuing students, the password you have already been using will work here as well. Please enable your notifications to keep up to date with any messages from HCCC. If this is your first time using the app, you'll be giving a survey that will talk about what kind of student you are. After you complete the survey, on your home page, you're going to click on the top purple button that says Appointments. Next, you're going to click the blue button on the bottom page where it says Get Help. Next, we are going to choose what we need help with and the date of our appointment. So in the top, we'll click Academic Advising. Next, we're going to say what we need help with. And lastly, we are going to pick a date when we are available for our appointment. Once we do that, we're going to click Find Available Time. Next, we're able to see the times that are available for both the Journal Square campus and the North Hudson campus. Here we can see what advisors are available and what times work for us. Once we pick something, we're going to click on that time. After selecting the time, we can see more details about the appointment so far. We can see our confirm our date, our time, our campus, and even the advisor. So next, we're going to put in some more details about the appointment. So first, we'll click on how we would like to meet. So their options are in person or virtual over Zoom. Next, we were going to type in more details about our appointment. After doing so, we're going to make sure that the text and email reminders are on and confirm our phone number. Once we're done, we're going to click where it says Schedule. Now that our appointment has been scheduled, we can even see on the app the details of our appointment. So here you have the day, the time, the location, and the Zoom URL. If we ever need to cancel, the Cancel Appointment button is on the bottom of it. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions, you could always reach out to the advising email.